So there's been a lot of talk about uh, in politics about whether or not Sir, San, uh, Bernie Sanders is electable or could defeat Trump. My basic uh, position on beating Trump is if you want to beat Trump, you can't be the same as him. You need to be the opposite. <laughs> In other words, don't be as bad as Trump, be better than Trump kind of thing. And amongst all the other possibles, to me it seems like the most opposite is Bernie. So, uh, he seems like the logical choice to me. And, you know, so with all the polls and all of this and all the studies and opinions and all that, if you don't want to lose, win. Pick a winner. Don't pick somebody who's like, I'm going to be in the middle or kind of do this and kind of do that and I'm only halfway bought out blah 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 because Trump will just use all that shit against you that's how he won he won in the first place he beats uh, Hillary because she was a centrist she uh, basically was saying you know I'm not as bad but not as bad doesn't mean you're better so it's still not good I, I don't understand what's the why people think that's a good idea This is kind of ridiculous here. Pay no attention to that. I'm only going like another f a couple blocks. I don't know why this has to be a battle. Well, yeah, of course I do. It's, it's uh, rush hour traffic, that's why. But it's not... It just seems, it seems crazy. I don't even think it's that late. I don't know why it's this uh, crowded. What is today? Tuesday? What's the big fucking deal with Tuesday? Why Tuesday gotta be like this? It is Tuesday. Anyway. Yeah, if you want to win, you know, pick the opposite. If you want to defeat the forces of evil, pick someone good. <laughs> if you want to defeat fear, pick love. And then just pick the best example of that. And in my opinion, the best example of overall is, is, is Sanders. And he's even shown it consistently through the decades. If you go back and look at some of his old stuff, it's, uh, he's, he's basically saying the same thing, you know? So he's trying to help people. Ugh, my hand's tired. I don't know what I did to my hand this last month or week. It's been really, really sore. I'm not sure why. I don't think I was doing anything super extra hard, but now this clutch has always been stiff, but of course, in my uh, enfeebled state, it's even more hard to hold it down. It was, it was just traffic. Stop and go was a lot of clutch work. So that was extra work. It's just like on a motorcycle, aim where you want to go. You want happy, you want loving, you want good, you want positive. Pick that candidate, and that's what you should be aiming for. Positive, loving, nurturing, supportive. If those are the things you want, pick that candidate. Don't pick somebody who's 100% the opposite. All I want to do is terrify you because that's all they know. They think that's power when that's actually a weakness, sign of weakness. And or someone who's like, well, I don't want to scare you that bad. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to do it quite that bad. But I'm gonna. I will do a little bit, but not that much. Not that much is still bad, you know. Lesser of two evils is still evil, as they say.
That's how we came today. Got the job done just fine. Thank you.